have a frozen tree is now open in house. Get the evil eye from Davis. That's yes, why. So joining us in the studio, one of the owners from Rita's Italian Ice and Frozen Custard, we have Stephanie Nieves. 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 Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much for being here. Yeah, yeah thanks for having me today. Yeah. Okay, yeah. so let's talk stuff. about Rita's yeah. and the library in the home. Well, we want to bring something that was new to the area. You know, there's very traditional Sorry. ice cream places and frozen yogurt places. There's even a shaved ice place, but there's no Italian ice. Yeah. Yeah. So we want to bring something that was going to be um, a little bit different. And so far, we've been very well received. Yeah, and for maybe folks who haven't had uh, some Italian ice, what is it? What makes it different? It makes Well, the difference between Italian ice and, say, like a shaved ice product is the way the product is made itself. So when you're going to get a, sh a shaved ice, you know, you, they take the ice and shave it down, and then they put in um, the syrup on top. Well, all of ours gets blended first, goes into a batch machine, and then it comes out with this glorious product. <laughs> so, and uh, how did you how did you find out about Rita's, or was it an idea that you started searching it out, and that's who you who you landed on? How yeah, did that work? we well, we had um, been talking about bringing something to Holland for over two years now, oh, okay. and um, one of my friends actually posted online that she was in a Rita's in Atlanta. Mm -hmm. And she posted that she had gotten a gelati, which is one of our famous products that has custard on the top of our Italian ice. Okay. And she's like, this is phenomenal. I wish we had it by us. And I'm like, that's it. That's what we need here. That's what's missing in West Michigan. Yeah, it's incredible. So, and this is a family affair, right? It is, so yeah. <laughs> yep, uh, the other owners are my mother and my sister. Okay. And yep, it's definitely, it's been a lot of fun working with them. Mom just told the funny. <laughs> Cherry, yeah. but you've got some other pretty good creations. We brought for you mango and cotton candy mm -hmm. today. There's over 90 flavors of Italian wow. ice. So we've got everything under the sun. We've got cookies and cream. We've even got horchata. We've got, wow. yeah, all kinds <laughs> of just phenomenal flavors. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's really yeah. cool. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So what is the plan now? Do you, I mean, is there plans to, you know, add more as you go or is it you going to stick to the one for now well we would love to do that um i know um, we had spoken to uh, franchise business consultant when she was here about possibly expanding our territory a little bit so you never know maybe we want to come out to grand rapids <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's be pretty yeah, that's <laughs> yeah. again when can folks come see you the hours of operation yeah yeah yep yeah, we open on saturday that was our official opening and we are open right. every day from 12 to 9. you said you had quite an opening we did yeah. it was crazy we had a constant flow of people which was just wonderful mm -hmm. and we've even had repeat customers already which is wow. i think that yeah. speaks to how wonderful the product mm -hmm. is so. yeah. italian ice is the way to go so yeah. i in new york and then <laughs> yeah. i went for a new york style pizza yeah. shop where they yeah. had italian ice yeah. and so yeah i'm a big fan yes so it's I'll awesome be to Holland soon. yes, yes yeah, please perfect. come see us yeah. and make sure you try yeah. some yeah. 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 all right you ready hey 27 and still ahead. Well, a four-year-old boy holding on to hope despite dealing with a rare form of brain uh, cancer. How you can help support them with a possible cure. And say good morning to our Facebook fan of the day. It is Lacey Saunders. That was good, huh? There you go. Mix things up with the